What's up, guys? I'm here to talk about Monday Night Football. No, it's not the NFL. It's the AFL again. And what I'm going to tell you guys right now, that if there's a game that, if you're trying to get into AFL and there's a game that you should watch that should get you into it, this is the game to watch. ESPN2 at 7 o'clock Central, Dallas Desperados versus Philadelphia Soul. This is the biggest rivalry uh, in the AFL, and they're the best teams in the AFL. Both teams are coming in undefeated, the only undefeated teams in the league. Dallas 7 and 0 coming off a bye and Philadelphia is 8 and 0. And we're going to Philadelphia. And I got to say every time these two teams get together, it's a slugfest and a lot of times a lot of scuffles during the game and uh, it's awesome and it's the all the guys are talented. These are top tier AFL players. I know that that sounds kind of stupid, you know, people make fun of minor league. These are really good football teams and they have great quarterbacks which makes them that good. You got Clint Dozell for the Dallas Desperados, one of the best uh, quarterbacks of all time. He's, a, he's able to – he's the offensive coordinator for the team. He's able to call his own plays and coach the guys on the field. He does a great job of that. Then you got Tony Graziani, who is one of the greatest quarterbacks of all time in NFL history. And he's able to uh, – you know, he's able to make crazy throws. I mean, you may have seen – it's made – his play one time where he fell down at the one-yard line, was able to throw it up as he went down into the end zone for a touchdown. Um, it made it to the top plays of, of sports center before. And it's on one of the top 50 plays, okay? So, I mean, this guy can play. So, what's going to happen in this game is it comes down to the quarterback play, and I think you're going to get solid guys, solid play from both guys. But what they have on us, though, is that their backup is really not a backup. You know, when Dalzell went down, we had Chris Sanders come in, who was a true rookie. And, uh, you know, when he went down, you know, we won all those games, but it was mostly, you know, I like the way Chris Sanders played, but it was mostly because of uh, – you know, the wide receivers were able to, to make a little bit better catches, and the defense mostly. The defense was able to hold teams, which is a lot to ask for defense in the AFL, but our guys did it. Um, we're playing a Philadelphia team, though, that's a lot like us in the fact that they will get after the pass rusher, and they're not going to let you score every single possession. We may be able to because we have that good of offense, but at the same time, they can as well. Um, but the thing is, we have Chris Sanders as the backup. So when Dozell goes down and Chris Sanders comes in, I don't think the rest of the team is going to be able to pick us up uh, without a great quarterback uh, to beat Philadelphia. On the other hand, Philadelphia, their backup is Cedric Bonner. Cedric Bonner is not a backup. Cedric Bonner is a is a proven star in, in, in the AFL. And, and, and Croziani went down earlier this season just like Dolzell did. Uh, but Bonner came in and took the reins and won those games. And I think Croziani is going to play. I know he's kind of banged up, but I think he'll come in because of the Desperados. Uh, but if he can't play the whole game, uh, we don't get a huge advantage with having Bonner come in. So... We're going to have a tough time with Philadelphia. Um, it's a big game. You know, it's not one of those make or break games, you know, because uh, it's just a regular season. If you know, and as Cowboys fans, you know, it's all about the playoffs now, and especially Desperados fans. You know, last year with 15 and 1 and lost in the first round. So we want to win, though. We want. We still want to win the division. Uh, this could come, it could come down to this. We're going to play them later down, later down the road in Dallas again, but it'll be good to get them on the, on the road in Philadelphia Monday night. So. Monday night, ESPN2, guys. I, I encourage you to watch. If you have time, watch the game. You know, if, if, you're, if your NBA team is not playing that night, turn on ESPN2 and watch the Desperados and the Philadelphia Soul. It's a great rivalry. You're going to see a couple of scuffles and fights maybe a little bit throughout the game, uh, and I think you're going to enjoy yourself. So let's go, Desperados. Let's go 8-0 and, and put them soul in their place. So John Bon Jovi sucks. <laughs> see you guys.